Live at noon, this is Fox 29 News Express. Happy Friday, everyone. Welcome to News Express. I'm Heather Ayub. Well, safety matters when determining where you and your family will live, work, and receive your education. To become an even safer city, the Lake Charles Police Department takes a look back each year and analyzes the numbers, an imperative task performed annually. Fox 29 News' Braylon Jenkins is live in the Fox studio with the answers. Braylon? That's right, Heather. Safety does matter when it comes down to it. And while they're all just numbers, each involves people in our community and the safety of others, which is why it is so important that police evaluate the data. The Lake Charles Police Department held their annual crime report press conference, which provided a statistical analysis on crime in the city of Lake Charles for 2012. According to the numbers, overall crime is reportedly down. Chief of Police Don Dixon began with overall criminal offenses. In 2012, looking at overall criminal offenses, there was a decrease of 3% in comparison to 2011. There were 263 less offenses. We then took a look at crimes against persons. 84 less offenses were reported, showing there was a 5% drop when compared to 2011. Chief Dixon then spoke about crimes against property, saying there were 24 fewer property crimes reported as compared to 2011, showing a 1% decrease. We're looking at other criminal offenses, there were 155 less offenses than in 2011, which showed a 5% decrease. What Chief Dixon was most proud of was the crime clearance rate. Looking at overall clearance of the 9,952 criminal offenses that were investigated, 5,239 were cleared, slightly lower than in 2011. As far as crimes against persons, there was a clearance rate of 86%. Crimes against property clearance, 33% were cleared. And other criminal offenses, there was a 68% clearance rate. Chief Don Dixon said that in 2012, the department had 26 less hired hands available to be on the street. However, that's about to change. With the uh, blessing of the city administration, this coming Monday, we have 12 new police officers who will be starting in this department. And the good news is, is that brings us to our complement of uh, 189 uh, for the first time in a long time. Chief Dixon said that a major part of the success was made thanks to the public and their assistance. The department divides the city into areas known as beats. There was one particular area that has a history of being a high crime area, and the police department is working to change that. One of those areas is located between the railroad tracks just south of 12th Street and east of 1st Avenue. In case you were wondering about how 2013 was going so far, for our city's first quarter, crime is down 15 percent. Raylan Jenkins for Fox 29 News. As Chief Don Dixon said, your input matters. If you even think you see anything suspicious, call the police and let them check into it. You never know when your hunch might just save lives. Visit watchfox29.com for more information on how to contact the authorities and give tips anonymously.